Ta-da! Ow. Packs today. Yeah. All good. About to head to packs. Got, got my shit packed. Red Bull. And, and, and thingies. And water. And I'm excited. Hey dudes, what's going on? Lash Seal here, and I'm here with my PAX vlog, finally. Um, just to let you know quickly, uh, there's going to be a lot of in PAX really loud like background noise, and hopefully it's not too annoying for your ear holes. And yeah, this is just me on a train going to PAX. That's where I get off. Um, yeah, so it's finally a PAX. This is just this is game of some sort. Age of yeah, that was Age of Mythology. Um, it's Hotline Miami too. At this point, I was with August and Zach, and we kind of yeah, just see them there. Huh? You're trying to break my cup. I'm trying to break oh my God. cup. I think I stepped on the game actually. <laughs> Shit. Okay. And it's August. Oh yeah. Awkward. Um. So yeah, the first day of PAX, I met Zach in August. Now it's really awesome. Um, it was really awkward at first, because uh, August and I kind of just stood there for a while, um, but we, then Zach came and everything was okay. Um, yeah, that's the thing. So I just went to the bathroom here and then I was coming back. I thought it would be funny. Um, August bought a portal gun, and then he was like, shit, I had to carry around this box the whole fucking time. And, yeah. I went to the bathroom again? What? <laughs> Shit, I didn't zoom in very well. <laughs> yeah, so the first day we kind of just walked around, we played a few games, not not too many. Um, just kind of walked around, bought some stuff. Um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, this was an awesome wall where we could write our names on with uh, like whiteboard marker, I guess. Uh, yeah, this was okay, that didn't work a well. Lego thing of uh, Wildstar, yeah, I think. Yeah, well, it's, it's always Then, yeah, after PAX, we went to a McDonald's. Going to the bathroom. Uh, yeah, the next day we went, uh, well the first day was just like looking around and stuff and then the next day we went to, to um, two packs but we didn't go in because we didn't have tickets. So what we, we there was like a meet up with a few YouTubers. Um, I took selfies with a bunch of them and got some signatures on my Friday packs pass and yeah, it was, it was pretty awesome. Um, then we went around Boston and just kind of explored there. Um, I found this awesome store a few days beforehand that um, I was like, we need to go to here. So then we went there and yeah, meeting meeting YouTubers was pretty awesome. Um, we met Shield Chaos, uh, we met him on Friday as well. Uh, we met Sark, we met uh, Gassy Mexican, Markiplier, um, Eat My Diction was there. Um, who else? I don't remember now. I think that was it. Because we met Captain Sparkles on Sunday. Um, I got his signature as well. Oh, Goldie was there. Uh, other people there. I don't know, I just kind of got some signatures. There'll be pictures here, I imagine. Uh, uh, I'm kind of recording this over other footage shit. I'm cutting out, so, so yeah, it's just random shit. Eh, okay. Good on Yeah, this is us at the fan meetup. <laughs> I found... I found your other. It's a thing. Now we're going 
down over here. Uh, shit. I'm filming the ground. This is really good. Really good blog. <laughs> yeah, we kind of just bummed around there for a while. Good times. Buildings. Oh, I'm stupid. Let me charge other people money. It was windy as fuck. I'm sorry about that. Oh, sorry, I was aiming for the water. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> Big thingy! <laughs> Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey look, a knife. August has a knife. I'm just gonna stab Zach. Zoom in on knife. <laughs> Fish! Fucking August, man. <laughs> yeah. What do you think it was? It's not. Stabby. <laughs> 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 yeah. yeah. Are you super annoyed now? No. Oh. Damn it. Look, it's the Liberty Mutual Insurance Company. That's really cool. And it's oh, I'll just edit that. I'll just edit it out after me screaming. So it's the final day of PAX, um, this day we played a whole lot more games. Um, we also managed to lose August a lot because he would get distracted by something. Um, that was alright, we always ended up meeting back up with him. This game is Naz Nazgoth, however you say it. Um, it's basically like vampires vs humans game, third person. Uh, this is Zach playing it and it looks really fun. Um, it's currently in like closed beta I think. Um, but we got a chance to play it here, and it was a lot of fun. I really sucked at it, but I don't think I got a chance to play as a vampire, but I got to play as a human, and that was, it was still fun. Uh, this game I know nothing about, but I think these guys made uh, a few other games, like Speedrunners, and um, No Time to Explain. Um, this is just me getting footage. There's like There were a few massive booth area things that were massive games like like Wildstar and the Blizzard thing and yeah um, there were a lot of cosplays around this guy was a companion cube but I think he didn't really take him down eye holes because he had to hold it up or she I don't remember um, to actually actually see and I just said yeah title of day three where's August because um, it's basically what it was <laughs> yeah 
Um, this game was a like a you're in space building stuff, um, but I was confused and stuff. Uh, this game actually looked really fun. I don't remember what it was called now, but Zach got a chance to play it. Basically, you have a spaceship and there's junk around, and you build your spaceship out of junk. Different things, different junk items do different things, and like you know, make you able to shoot guns or whatever. Um, and yeah, I think you, it's about exploration, this game and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I didn't get a chance to play it annoyingly, but it was a lot of fun. Um, this is Zach. He managed to rope another ship. And then he crashed the game. And it was funny. Good times. Now August is here. Um, yeah, this game is a, like a... Annoyingly for them, I think it kept crashing or something, or like technology was being annoying and not working. But basically this game is an RTS zombie thing where you can be the zombies or the humans fighting the zombies. Um, different zombies do different things, or like are armoured and do damage or whatever, stuff like that. Um, there's an Octodad and Hotline Miami 2 next to each other. Um, Fract is like a music game thing. Yeah. Oh, I think I filmed this game just because it was on the Wii U, and there aren't really many games on the Wii U, and I plan on getting a Wii U at some point in the future. Um, mainly for games like New Zelda games whenever they come out and stuff like that. And I really badly need a sneeze. Holy shit. Oh, God! Oh yeah, they were trying to be like, hey, you should photobomb those people, because I was doing it, I was doing it to people a bit, um, like I think I did it to August. Yeah, there's, there was a guy that looked like Jesus, I think it was meant to be dressed as Jesus, so I filmed him blurrily. Oh, that thing was like, you got to put on an Oculus Rift and then run around in a sphere. I think you got to collect things and stuff, but... Again, there was a line, didn't bother trying to go in it, and it was run by some university, I think. Um, but yeah, it looks like it would have been really cool to go in, but yeah. Basically, my vlogs are uh, zoom in on August and his face, and try and annoy him, or whatever. Basically, I'm really good at doing vlogs. Yeah, this is him buying PS1 games. wall again. What they did is they wiped the wall and then people got to draw and stuff on it again. Um, so that was pretty cool. Uh, what we did the first day was just August and I found it and we wrote our names and then this day we all wrote our names. We all wrote like our Twitter things but I doubt we got any followers or whatever but still why not. Um, this was again like another RCS game um, I know nothing about it, didn't get the chance to play, but yeah, it looks kind of fun. Oh no, August died again. Oh, what's that? Oh! oh. Zach's going to buy a hat now, I guess. Which hat should I get? Hat one. Don't really get that one, I don't know what it is. Should I get a piggy? I initially went to without really trying. 
but then he just squatted some more. Uh, yeah. Well, that's August's eulogy. What, what if that woman got really excited at first? She's like, ah, oh, and then they put the other one out. She's like, ah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, now August was a person. Now he's not because he's dead. Shit. Put it on the Friday one. I'll wear it. Duck in front of me. <laughs> Next exciting episode. <laughs> <laughs> it still hasn't decided to my knowledge. But look. Oh shit, I had zooms and I didn't mean to. And he's actually posing, so that's cool. I'm gonna get a front view. Yeah! I haven't played the game. Which hat did he choose? Which hat did he choose? Holy shit, it's a pig! <laughs> August is Jesus because he came back from the dead. See, look, he's there. Cool. going again but yeah as I was saying before didn't really get a chance to play big games because um, there were big queues for big games but we played a lot of indie games um, yeah so there was there was a fighting game that was um, not finished yet but it was still playable um, like there were that Zach and I played um, it had like the character I picked in particular was like not colored yet when it was in the fighting stage but it was still able to play it um, and yeah, it was a lot of fun. There are obviously a lot of indie games there. Um, I think most were finished or at least in beta. Um, yeah, not many games were... There was Octodad was there and you were able to buy it for a bit cheaper there, like $10 as opposed to $15. Um, there weren't any or many other games that did that, um, which I think is not... I, I wish a lot more games did what Octodad did, because um, I actually bought Octodad and plan on streaming it or something in the future. Um, this is Zach playing Titanfall. I don't think it was a specific booth for Titanfall, but like for um, like the screen or something. I don't really remember. Maybe it was like the mice or whatever. Um, this game was. I didn't really look at it too much, but it seemed to have like an RTS type thing to it. There were people playing to it, and there was a guy commentating, but as you can see, people had one um, headphone ear thing off their ear so they could hear what was going on. Um, so I thought it was a bit weird that they did that, but like, I don't know. I still don't know the name of it or anything, but it looked fun. Yeah, that was the um, fighting game booth thing that we filmed that we played on, so they like built it specifically for packs, um, then it kind of just 
didn't have it all and there was a weird footage here. Um, as you might be able to hear the, I think it's Song of Storms from Zelda, but like a weird kind of version of it. Um, there were some guys kind of next to this booth that were jamming out playing it. Um, you'll get to see some footage for that in a second. Um, yeah, they were playing it, it was really cool, like they had like just like two little keyboard things that obviously had different types of notes or whatever on them and they were just, they were just playing it and it was, it looked fun. Yeah, that was a game that, um, I don't know, was, yeah, there, there were the guys and what I thought was cool about it was that they were like just sitting there jamming out but making, or well, like remixes of other music, like old video game music. Specifically like Nintendo, because I guess that's like easier to do, I guess. I don't know. August died again. Yeah, so this is when I met Kevin Sparkles. Um, yeah, there were lots of kids around him because of Minecraft. And I'm glad I filmed this because it's funny. Um, yeah, that game was a... There was like a booth that had lots of indie games. I think they were mainly kind of like iPad games. Um, Zach, we didn't really find out what we had to do, but I think Zach talked to the developer or whatever of it, but I didn't hear. Um, yeah, this is August. Oh no, this is August and Zach meeting Utah, which I don't really know, I don't want his stuff. August meets Captain Sparkles.
him. Get him. Get him. Don't, don't, don't forget to win. You got this. Get that thing. What does that thing even do? I don't know. I'm just shooting like robots and phones and shit. Oh, what the hell? That was a little bit bullshit. Yeah, this was a booth we found that was um, a game made by, well, games made by like university students of some sort. Um, and this is one of the games that played. I don't know. This might have been all it was. I guess I don't know. Um, a bit later, I played like a horror game, and it was just a really quick demo, I guess. And there was only one actual scare, in my opinion. Um, but yeah, the last day we just played lots of games. Um, it was a really, really awesome weekend. Um, I'm really glad that I went. Um, and basically, PAX and meeting Zach and Ulis was the highlight of my whole trip. Um, there's going to be a separate vlog for the US trip. Because um, as you can tell, this vlog is already really long and it's only for a weekend. Um, yeah, I really enjoyed it. Um, Hopefully going to be able to do it again next year. Um, hopefully with more money and stuff. Uh, hopefully not be dead like I was a bit. Um, and hopefully actually get more vlog footage and stuff like that. I don't know. Um, what I'm also hoping will happen next year is that I'll be able to... I'll be big enough to be able to do like a bit of a fan meetup. Whether that be like one random person or more. I don't really care, but it would be awesome. Um... But yeah, that's the vlog of PAX. Yeah! I got a bunch of stuff, met Zach in August, and had a fucking awesome weekend. And I couldn't thank you guys enough as well, because you guys are what helped me get there. Even though I don't get any money from YouTube, um, if I wasn't doing YouTube, I still, I probably most likely wouldn't be going to PAX. Um, I've never been to a gaming convention thing before. I did, when I was in Europe, go to a... Uh, dream hack thing, that was a lot of fun, but this PAX, I could actually play games and stuff, um, which was a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, as I was saying, you guys are what got me there. Um, back in August in particular, because um, if I hadn't met those guys, then, you know, I probably wouldn't be going there. Uh, wouldn't be spending all my money to go to America, but that's okay. Um, yeah. It was, it was, it was awesome. Uh, I want to thank you guys for watching, not only this video, but all my other videos, all like fucking 400 of them, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!